You're failing the IQ test. And why did you leave your house when when you had COVID? I Honestly, you it. sound like an idiot, so there's not much to say. I hate that he's Italian-American, by the way, because it plays into his stereotype. A restaurant owner in California posted signs calling on customers to show proof that they have not gotten the vaccine. He's also banned diners from wearing masks inside and put up this massive billboard that says, leave the mask, take the cannoli. Of course, it has to be an Italian guy and he's using the godfather. See, what you're not, get, what you're not getting, you're, you're, you're failing the IQ test. What you're not getting, which I expected, um, what you're not getting is that uh, this, is not, this is not an anti-vaccine stand. It's a pro-freedom stand. That's what you're not getting. The whole really? reason this is happening is because people won't protect themselves, Tony. I mean, what are you thinking? Then why did you leave your house when when you had COVID? I mean, you had it and you left your house. I mean, it's been documented. First right? of all, so it has been documented. My ass, it's been documented. Why I quarantined. Why, why I went out. It? My wife got accosted by somebody. I don't know, man. You're and I, I know you don't know. So I'm trying to help you. I don't want you, you to get sick the way I was the sick. science is clear. Oh, you care about me all of a sudden, huh? Enough to have you on the show because I don't like people uh, making bad decisions for themselves and their family. I was hoping it was a little bit of a stunt. Oh, you have the freedom not to take the vaccine. Well, I just ask, don't know why you think it's a good move. Maybe we should ask your brother about protecting people, right? I hey, mean, look, that's his job. Uh, and if he doesn't you know, do it well, whole, people won't whole, vote for him. a whole new can of worms. But don't, look, Tony, look, I don't Listen, know if you know me too well. My, I'm not shy away my from stand much. is not I'm a political you about stand. You. Good. I appreciate that, too, because I know you talk a lot. So, so my... My stance here is a pro-freedom stand only. It's not political. You'll never gonna. If you come down here, you're not gonna see a Trump flag flying mm -hmm. over the roof. Okay, you're not gonna see campaign s signs. You're not gonna see campaign slogans or political slogans ever. Okay, mm -hmm. you're only gonna see pro-freedom messages, and that's it. This is not about whether I'm pro-vaccine or not. I'm pro-freedom, anti-tyranny. Okay. And, uh, you know, may maybe the conversation should really be between me and your brother. You're pro-freedom, but people can't wear masks. Tony, it doesn't make sense. It really doesn't. I gave you a chance to make the case. I wish you well. I hope your family stays safe. I made my case. You didn't have much to say. You didn't have much to say. I mean, so I honestly, you sound like an idiot, so there's not much to say. But, Tony, good luck with it. See you. And so do you. Yeah. I, so I, you. Only for having you on the show. That was my only mistake. Look, it's just stupid. I hate that he's Italian-American, by the way, because it plays into his stereotype. It is such a false sense of strength. It is such a stupid, ethnic, stereotype, masculine, moronic thing to be. But guys like this, I was hoping it was a stunt. It's not. Joke's on me. But I'll tell you what, don't be like him. We'll be right back.